these red flowers? I think those are red flowers. Also, hello everyone and welcome back to Corona's Place Final Fantasy 13 2. Today, I'm apparently gonna throw Mog into red flowers to apparently get something special. Did I miss? I think I missed. Uh, you're right above it. Uh, Chichu, okay. I believe. Well, it said unique monster, it didn't give me a name. So let's go check that bad Larry out. Uh, Commando, pretty high stats actually. Great two. Uh, zippy, tasty. Uh, pack mentality, I don't know what that is. This is the strength of magic when all monsters in Paradigm Pack are the same type. Oh, so like if I have all commandos, then all my stats go up? Good lord. A meteorite, sweet, should name you Tella. And that's it, let's see. I, do I have anything to level you up? Actually, I was told this is like, this is the only time you can get this dude, I think the comment said, so I should probably not just level up willy-nilly. I only got two potent slivers and... At 20 power slivers, he does seem like it's focused on extra. To be fair, actually, his, his magic stat isn't that bad compared to his physical stat either. Uh, can I look at your abilities? Got ATB charge, yeah. Okay. You got feral speed too. Don't know exactly what that means. Oh, you got a quick paradigm, it looks like. You don't have. Oh, no, you have down here too. Hmm, tempting. Can I actually rename you Tella? <laughs> now that I think about it, I think Tella would be a great name for you. Uh, just select a name, please. All. Go down to T. Zeus. Let's see, Tella. I'm disappointed. Alright, well, cool. We maybe level that little dude up. He's a unique monster, but Buttercup is holding the ground right now. That dude respawned because it's sunny. This is the one... Hello? Anybody new? Eh. Nah. Run away real fast. Till they go away. Please go away. Why aren't you going away? Thank you. Uh, this was the teleporter that I used in between episodes, a couple of episodes back that uh, gave me that fragment. Alright, so now that we got that out of the way, there's apparently a chocobo lady that I can talk to in serendipity that has a fragment just waiting for me. Yo, okay. <laughs> I actually have run by this little dude a lot. Speaking of which, I wonder how Saz is doing. Yeah, right, the cutscene showed him. I'm assuming he did. Uh, Choco Chick down. Oh, <laughs> you mean the feathers. All right, cool. So I think that's it here for now. I mean, I can do gambling, I can do races. Um... I need to level up chocobos, to, like get better chocobos for racing though. Uh, the casino slots, that's like mostly just luck based, right? So I'm sure there's like an RNG manipulating type deal that you could do for it. I'm, I'm just not going to do that right now. Maybe I'll come back in between episodes and gamble a little bit every now and then, or just purchase a ton of uh, coins with extra gill. So we get Augusta Tower. We just came from there and I don't know if there's anything else to do there. And then there's the Academia. 13 fragments. One fragment. Well, okay. Let's go to one fragment. AF. The Academy built the Augusta Tower as a central information processing facility with an enormous artificial intelligence at its core. But now, centuries in the future, the system has suddenly begun to run a Shocking. Haven't they ever seen Terminator? The network system was attacked from somewhere in the future. Oh. When the Academy tried to respond and shut down the system, it was too late. The AI had already taken control of much of the Academy. Huh, fair enough. Alright, let's see what's happening. There's more loading, and that's apparently... Oh! Okay. If this were to occur, history would be infused with contradiction. Ah, snow. This would lead to a distortion causing the entire world to collapse. Kinky. The subjects require further analysis. Hypothesis. Their existence has initiated a distortion in history. Y yeah. Oh, okay. 
I'm not very good with all this fancy machinery. You don't say. Here exactly. The system that controls this facility has been hacked by someone from the outside. Wherever they are, they're trying to use the network in an attempt to override the system. So you guys actually seen the cutscenes from outside in the history of Crux as well? Took over the tower. Well, there's an easy solution for that. We just need to find him and solve this whole problem. Case closed. AKA murder. The system's been hacked too. So the security bots are just pieces of metal. And I don't think the person behind this is actually physically here. So no murder. It seems like the culprit isn't even in this time at all. What's with the red stuff? They're accessing the system from somewhere in the future. Are they watching us? For us, we have the means to get there. Let's give them a piece of our minds. Come on. Uh, Anomaly and Augusta. A future paradox infests the Augusta Tower in 300 AF, turning its chambers and passages into a confusing maze. Yay. Restore the rooms to the correct positions and resolve the anomaly. So, I guess the red stuff is just here to stay. On that note, go Moog! Moog? Mog. Yep, you, you pushed a button. Good job. Revolving rooms. I guess the tower has turned into a paradoxal maze. Use those switches to rotate the rooms and make your way through the tower. Connecting open doors with passages will open the path before you. Learn which switches move which rooms in order to progress. Hey, you didn't give me anything. You might have given me something, I don't know. Because I'll just wait. Oh, one gill. How about this? Hold on, oh, you can't go through the door? But is the door like actually like connected thing? And one more gill, huh? All right, we need to find a map. One. Is the loneliest number that I've ever known. Kupo could be the saddest one, but it's the loneliest number. I don't know the rest of the words. Just give me the chest, please. Thank you for the 800 gil. Hello? <laughs> that is the map. Give me more slimes, huh? Some creepy looking little bastards. Uh, Fla <laughs> Flanborg, huh? They're blocking... stuff. What were they blocking? Physical? What were you blocking? You were blocking some- uh, lightning. You were blocking lightning! Probably should not actually have the little dude out then, huh? Little dude, like, uses mainly lightning? To be honest, we're actually kicking their ass. They're... They stand no chance. Like, Buttercup is... Like, backhanding the living bejesus out of them. It's awesome! I was kind of hoping we get one of them. Oh, I didn't see what kind of class they were. 300? Oh, we did get one. Okay, I didn't see the crystal or the white. Uh, let's see what you are. You're a calm. I have a lot of those. I got Armor Breaker, Resist Imperil, Imperil, Bloodthirsty. I kind of want to know what that is. I'm assuming you get stronger, like, the more you kill. Like, that would make sense to me. Oh, yeah. Hold up. Indeed. Kupo Kupo. You got that. I'll probably just walk and get that later, but I'm lazy. I like throwing Mog. Thank you for the mana slivers. That's my mod. Oh, no more of these guys. I mean, I would attack you, please. Sarah! I don't think I have anyone that could use the potent engine stuff yet. I mean, my pulse work knight, he's kind of maxed out. And I, I mean, probably that, uh... The other hoplite dude that we got, who wasn't a hoplite, but I forget the name of him, uh, probably could use them. Is there anything here? Gotta say, this little filter over the screen is rather nauseating. Two? Oh, hey, you're new! Oh no, you're the guys that make the alarm noise, aren't you, from the 13th? It was the first game. Yeah, it is the first game. Are you the guys, uh, 
Flanator? No, you're not. You're a medic, though. That's kind of dope. Oh, nope, you definitely clearly are the dude making the annoying noise. Please stop. Drop and open up shop. Please kill them. Just keep killing. Okay. There's one down. Maybe we'll get one. We could use another medic. Just so, like, the humans wouldn't have to do it. 300 and some gill and we did get and transient as uh, transparent ooze All right, how cool are you? You have a lot of magic good lord I guess that means your healing spells will be pretty good improved cure ally K KO power surge You got two Cures you got the better cure and the regular cure. What can you learn? Can you learn revive relatively fast? Asuna Cheer. I don't know what cheer does. And resist fog. I'm assuming eventually you get rays. Right? You're grade three. What do I have? I don't. Oh, you can have the potent engine. Huh. I think you're the only one that can have the potent engine right now. Uh, it's tempting, to say the least. I wouldn't mind. I mean, to be fair, right now, aside from its HP, it'd probably do as good a job as healing as, like, everyone else. Except maybe Noel. Noel, Noel actually does... Well, no. Noel's pretty crap at magic, so... That probably is not the case. Yeah, actually, what is your magic? Can't see it here. We should level these guys up anyways. Uh, what are we leveling on you, Sarah? Oh, we're getting Commando, right, to get to Jeopardize. As well as get you a little bit more beefy with your attack. As for you, I think we're gonna go... We're done with Medic for now. We got all these. We focus Commando for you, or try to increase your magic so you can actually do some decent healing. We, get two, we got a lot more left there. Um, sure, we'll go, we'll go Commando for now. Six more. Alright. That's probably fine. Another door. Anything new? No, we'll uh, just run by you for now. It's hard to believe that all of this is happening because of one person hacking into the system. Now, what is this, Tron? Maybe. Just maybe. Okay, let's go push the button. No map yet, though. Hopefully I didn't miss it. Uh, rotate the room. Yes, thank you. Oh, hi! Oh, we gotta go after the healer first. I gotta admit, I feel like... Just Commando, Commando, Commando right now is just more effective than switching between everything. Like going from Relentless to Tri Disaster. I feel like maybe going Relentless to Cerberus is probably better, but the damage output doesn't seem that much like, actually it just seems straight up way better than uh, going one way to the other. Okay, so we need to rotate this room one more time. But I'll kill them first, I guess. Getting a transparent ooze like every fight, which I guess is good. I don't know if it is worth anything or if like we can make any armor out of it. Probably something. Thanks, I am perfect. You're right. Dude, if you hit me with a mega flare, I'm gonna be mad. Uh, the circular device in the middle of the room serves as an elevator. Use the elevator to go to the next floor. Thank you, voice in the head. I can always count on you. Dead ends all around. Good. Ma, go! I threw that poor bastard to his death. 
It's sad, really. You gonna come back? M Mog? Oh god, I actually killed the poor bastard. Oh, hey, one gill, are you back yet? Hi. You're right, that was no good. Please be new. You're new! Come here. I must ask you a question. He has a sword, Kronos. Don't worry about it. Uh, Trex... Trectator... Uh, Trectoron? You're a synergist. Okay, you're a machine. You're also, like, extremely dead, by the way. We didn't get you, though. Were you, like, one of the hunts from Final Fantasy Twelve? Like, the first hunt we got? At least the name sounds really familiar. It's probably a standard Final Fantasy name. Oh, are we gonna have, like, a wave battle? Probably. No? Okay. I'm actually surprised by that. Hey, Mog. Crap, it's another cutscene. I better get something if he finds it. Get to the top floor. Mog, did you really not find anything? All I want, Mog, is items. Chocolina, what are you doing here, girl? Did you come to check out my chocotastic selection of goods? Yeah? But seriously, it's dangerous here. Droplets. I hope you upgrade this inventory soon. Uh, what do you have that's new and exciting? I don't think you have anything new or exciting. Weapons, you don't have anything. We need a couple more shattered bones to get that. Items, you got nothing really at all, actually. Well, that's good. I guess I'll buy like a few more greens. Not that many. Like four. There we go. Sell anything? Sell a lot of things, actually. Components, yeah. Not worth, well, actually worth more than everything else here, except for the first two items. Huh. Well, that power booster is worth a fair amount, and actually it's for grade four monsters. When did we get those? I have to say, you have a really good eye. Thanks. Hi. Maybe I will upgrade that Flaninator, dude. Oh, we're getting a lot of the potent engines. Oh, there's an item in there. Get it, Mog. Can you just walk in there, Kronos? No. Mog must get it. He didn't get it. All right. Goodbye, Mog. Oh, you can teleport, you little sneaky... Sneaky dee devil. I know. I am perfect. Map, please? Uh, Vitality Bolts. It's like a map. Hmm. Is this the only way here? Oh, there's something over there, actually. Yo, no, shut up. Hello. This dude only gives 16 experience points? What the hell? <laughs> what is it? Why? Why would you do that? You are? You're the only Moogle. Thank you for the vitality slivers. I don't think there was anything over there. Double check. I'll probably avoid any encounter. We might be able to throw someone over there. Nope. Alright. Cool. Let's come over here and spin this thing right round, baby. Right round like a record, baby. Really? Alright. Spin the room. Good job. I did nail that one. That's a very weird floor. 
I mean, we're back to one already, huh? I'm just gonna use this while I'm standing on it. It probably put me on it anyways. Yeah. Okay. Sure, investigate the suspicious room moving by itself. Oh, I see you. You're mine. You don't even know it yet. You got that. Probably. Oh, yeah, you got it. Uh, thanks for the Phoenix down. Those do come in handy. We thankfully don't have to use them that often. We do have a medic, though, like these guys. Okay, let's see. So this one moves this room. We don't need that room. Oh, I guess we probably could have adjusted it so we could walk over there, right? Anything down here? There's an elevator. But I don't want to go there just yet. And then there's an item over here. More flans? Well, you guys give all right experience, but at the same time... Leave me alone. Give me a new enemy. Oh, we can't actually make it over there. Thank you for the lever scope. I actually could use more of those. Um, hmm. I don't know how. Maybe... You can adjust the room, the blue room that we showed up in. I guess we go up in the elevator? And then... That doesn't make any goddamn sense. Can I throw myself over there? Yeah, that just leads there. Which isn't that good. So I don't think this button has anything to do with it. So I'm just going to set it back to the way it should be. Unless, unless there's like a, a thing that comes out of there. Could be missing something inside the room too, but I haven't seen any like pop up saying, hey, you can use this. Yeah. Yeah, there's nothing here. I guess let's go to the elevator. Oh! Hello! Ooh, can I get you? You look kind of dope. Let me guess. Orion, you are, let's see, a commando? Oh, totally. <laughs> Shocking! You're a commando, you don't say! Who would have thought? There's a lot of commandos in this game, huh? I would have imagined like a healthy mix between like commando and uh... Ravager with a scattering of the other ones. I do want one of those guys though. Potent ship two... Or three, an analog circuit. Potent ship. I don't even know what grade that is. Uh, Buttercup, you are rank three, right? Can you use a potent ship? You can't, so it's probably rank two then. Oh no, it's mechanical though, right? You're potent engine. Maybe it's rank four. That doesn't make any sense. Maybe it does. I don't know. One second. Uh, potent. Oh, it's got to be rank two. Yeah, okay. Sure. I kind of want one of those guys, though. Like, that'd be great if you could just, I don't know, reappear. You spawned when I was here. So I'm going to assume you're going to spawn again. Oh my god, can you spawn, please? I'm starting to get dizzy. You're not the thing that I'm looking for. I'm gonna run around here for a second and see if I can get another uh, Orion to repair. Aren't those like manned mechs though? 
in Final Fantasy 13, those were like soldier operated mechs, I thought. Ah, more flans. Like a lot more flans. Ah, well, we'll, we'll move on. Actually, how much CP have we gotten? Huh, not that much. Actually, it's probably in close to enough to finish Sarah off in Commando for now. Right? Let's see. 500. So it needs five more levels. So no, not even close. And by not even close, I mean she's two levels off. After she's done there. Maybe Saboteur? Could give her some love in Sentinel. Or just try to get these three abilities in Synergist. I mean, I probably shouldn't be spreading out my levels that much. Like, right now. Maybe late game, that's fine, but... Right now, it might just be making it harder on myself. Which is fine. I like making it harder on myself sometimes. I don't know why. Uh, access thir Uh, item has been detected in a previous time period. Get in there, Mog. Is there anything weird in there? Like a bad guy? Or like... A monster? That's like, wants to join me? One guild, Mog? I hate you. I don't hate you, Mog. You're actually awesome. Alright, so... Previous time period. Previous time period. What time period was this connected to? Access card 13? Or was it... Tear? Yasif? Um, Missif, whatever. Okay, well, we'll come back here. Find the three fallen stars! Holy crap, I actually forgot about that. Yo, I actually completely forgot about... Okay, oh wow, okay, so I have two side quests here, huh? You don't have anything, do you? No, of course you don't. You're just a no-name researcher. Yeah, I saw one quest icon, I'm like, and on here, there's only one quest. Oh, never mind, there's two, I just didn't see it. Uh, alright, silly me. Okay. Well, I don't know how well we'll do against that Seath again, but maybe we can spend some time looking for the three fallen stars next time, but, uh, let's go up here first. There might be, like, a hidden treasure somewhere. Maybe. Just talk to Hope. I'll try to help in any way I can. can. Can I have a key for a future tower, maybe? I still find it hard to believe though, that my memories can just change like that. Yeah, it's a little weird. So is there nothing like back here or anything like that? Really? It's gotta be somewhere. I mean I guess it doesn't have to be in the past, right? It's at a, a distant timeline, right? So it could be in the future, I guess. Maybe. Hey, go get me something. Yeah, I don't know. Hmm. Thank you for the one gill. Do this 20,000 times and I actually might pay off. Alright, well... I guess that's gonna be it for this episode. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press like below. If you're not subscribed yet, why don't you my videos so I can check out some of the content. See if it's to your liking. If you're interested in watching me live stream on twitch.tv slash chronosplays, give my channel a follow to be notified when I go live. Either way, thanks for watching. Hope you all have a great day.